there was definitely cannibalism happening in the antebellum days. I recommend people checking out this book, The Delectable Negro. I shouldn't have done the chef kiss, but... There's a part in the book that talks about the transatlantic slave trade and how white men on the ship would eat the black men on board. They would spend months out at sea and they would overpack the ship with enslaved people knowing that they would lose cargo. Food had to be rationed and sometimes they would get hungry enough to eat their cargo. Rumor of cannibalism was kind of quickly dismissed because America had to keep this image that they were a civilized society with all their guns and colonization. So yeah, white people did eat black people and they try to hide that part of history just like they threw our babies to the gators or they had breeding farms all throughout the South. Well, there you have it. Now you see why they trying to pass laws and put laws in place where we can't teach the youth and teach our own this type of history because they've been trying to hide it and suppress it for the longest. But they'll try to have classes where they'll try to make it look like slavery wasn't a big deal. But, you know, I would like to thank this uh, young lady, you know, for her knowledge and sharing this knowledge. Her Instagram is called uh, his daughter underscore uh underscore seven so if you on instagram you know check her out you know we need more people like her at the end of the day they can't stop us from buying these books and learning ourselves you know what i'm saying and they can't stop us from teaching our youth but this is the reason why they came up with that bullshit ass terminology critical race theory because they're saying it's a theory they're trying to get you to believe that it didn't happen or it may have happened or, you know what I'm saying? It's a lie. Falsehood. Anyway, thank you for listening. This your boy Town Biz. I'm out.